hey everyone, from the G-Stick here back inside of Plants vs. Zombies, and today I'm doing Explodinator. Yeah. Take that, goddammit. <clears throat> hey everyone, from the G-Stick here back inside of Plants vs. Zombies, and today I'm doing Explodinator, where you have to kill 10 zombies at once using one single cherry bomb. And believe it or not, this is a lot simpler than you think it is, especially if you use... A second controller like you see I'm about to do here because this is shortly after I did versus 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 again try to saying that ten times fast and we're gonna do ourselves a custom battle mainly so we can pick out the plants and the, the plants and zombies exactly that we need primarily the sunflower the cherry bomb the walnut and uh, a few others and unfortunately you do have to swap back and forth and uh, that's one of the things you do have to do unfortunately you just have to swap back and forth and once you do, in fact, get all of them done, you can actually start doing uh, what you need to do. Because first of all, you need to get enough uh, sunflower points in order to get the uh, get the cherry bombs rep repeatedly. And you need enough of the zombies built up all at once to summon them all, uh, all at once. So you can just get as many in one small location that you can get, which is what I recommend doing. So as you see here, I just finish. I'm finishing up all of the preparation for this achievement. Uh, this is not an easy achievement, but it's not very hard either. It's right in the middle, uh, mid-level, especially once you uh, get the versus mode. I believe right after level 110, or level one, or section one, level 10, something like that. But anyways, you see here, I'm basically just building a crap ton of sunflowers, as many as I can build. And with the second controller, I have uh, the controller gathering as many brains as it can, mainly because, as you can see. Each zombie costs about 200, roughly give or actually about 100 or so, give or take. And of course, this makes it a lot more difficult. <coughs> Not difficult, der. Sorry, my cold is still around, so I'm still a little iffy. So anyway, put up as many of the walnuts as you can, because that'll help stall. And then of course, the cherry bombs, of course, have them already prepared. Don't bother using them immediately, nearly because it gets a little annoying. Now, I will have a bit of a longer section coming up next, mainly because it's a failed attempt, but it's a generalized concept of what you should do, the first, at least, to get this done, because this may take you one or two tries to get correct. So, as you see here, I'm about to summon as many as I can. Uh, try not to use the, uh, the flag, the flag bearer, as this does get annoying. Try to summon as many of the regular zombies as you can, mainly because this makes it a lot easier, uh, as you can see. But uh, just keep it on going, and once you get enough of them, of course these walnuts, try to keep them in the uh, first two lanes, because I don't, I'm, I believe the blast radius, I, I think is like two spaces. So try and get like five in each, it helps uh, immensely, so just get about five zombies per, and once you do, actually I do do this right the first time around, yay editing. But anyway, once you do in fact get it all right, have a have a cherry bomb all set on your, second, on your first controller, or at least the account you want to get this with. And since there is sun and death, you gotta just gotta place it in the right spot, especially if it goes on for a long ass time. I set it in the right spot, walnuts, whatever you need to do. And then of course, once you got enough of them together, summon the cherry bomb, and you should get 10 in that strike alone, giving you the 20 gamer score achievements, which of course in an arcade game is quite a lot. But anyway, there you guys go. Thank you guys for watching. If this helped you hit like if you want to see more, why not click on that picture down there in the lower right hand corner? Go to my channel. I don't know, maybe click subscribe or check out the previous video, Versus Versus Versus, where I went five rounds in a row using a second controller. And as always, have a great and beautiful day, and hopefully I will see you guys all next time.